Oh, yeah. This one's called You'll Never See a Nipple in the Daily Express, which isn't far, <laughs> far short of the truth when you come to think of it. I've seen letters that lost after immigrants' blood from people in Surrey, meaning nothing but good. I've seen fairy tales turned into facts concerning strikers' terrorist stats. I've seen how democracy is under duress, but I've never seen a nipple in the Daily Express. <laughs> If freedom is threatened by those who are free, then by all means hang them from the Tyburn tree. The lynch mob mentality must have its voice. This newspaper is its natural choice. Margaret Thatcher looks stunning, yes, but why no nipples in the Daily Express? <laughs> this paper is boring, mindless and mean. It's full of pornography, the kind that's clean. Where William Hickey meets Michael Caine again and again and again and again. <laughs> You'll hear all kinds of ugliness in hideous excess, but you'll never find a nipple in the Daily Express. <laughs> <laughs>